A little boy is shuffled from foster home to foster home, all the while dreaming of a forever family. Today, he's not only found that home, but inspired a business that will help thousands of other children. As Channel 8's Chris Haas tells us, it all began with the mystery of Christmas milk. They called us and said, we have a, a, uh, an eight-year-old little boy who's uh, in need of a home, and are you willing to uh, take a look at it? That question led to then eight-year-old Joey. When we dropped him back off at the foster home, he had, had never seen a navigation system in a car. And he asked what it did, and we told him, and he said, so will you be able to find me again? And so we said yes. Shane and Heidi Fussell adopted Joey out of state foster care in December of 2008. Soon the little boy came to his new parents with a request. He had kept asking uh, us for a drink that he had in, in foster care, and so I, I gave him all different types of drinks. He kept talking about this drink, and we were trying to figure out, I mean, seriously, is it juice? No. Christmas came around, and, and I gave him some eggnog, and he, he tasted it, and he said, Dad, Dad, that's it. It's Christmas milk. A few months later, Heidi lost her job, and the couple remembered Christmas milk. They took a chance. Called a dairy, created an eggnog. Nothing else tastes like it. it I mean, it does. It tastes like melted vanilla ice cream. And In June, they got their first break. Kroger agreed to carry the Christmas milk eggnog. I made a fool of myself. I actually cried in front of her. Central Market and Brookshire soon followed. The Fossels are donating 10% of sales to the Second Chance program at Fort Worth's Gladney Center for Adoption that works to find foster children forever homes. More needs to be done for children in foster care in this country. The Fussells recently found three more reasons that's true. Two little girls and another boy. The children that last fall became Joey's new brother and sisters. In Fort Worth, Chris Hodge, Channel 8 News. That's a great story. Great things going on when people really care about each other. That's right.